good morning how you baby daddy your sister and your cousin what i'm doing and you're happy too how y'all living fam it is uh tuesday up in this motherfucker and your girl's up in home depot again i'm actually looking for curtains um nothing cray cray but just some simple curtains i can put in my beauty room because you guys already know um if i didn't mention it before i might have and y'all know sorry for repeating I have a tendency to do that when I forget what I have in my vlogs. But your girl then got some more furniture for her beauty room, which is pretty much the biggest pieces of furniture that I needed. So I finally got those pieces. I got like a couple of drawer type things. I got another desk for my room. I got, that has some storage on it. And um, what else did I get? I got four items, basically. So it's supposed to arrive any freaking day now. I got the notification saying it's been shipped. Y'all know the last time I had to get a desk and it was a hot ass mess getting the desk actually in my hands okay so i'm praying that that doesn't happen again but in the meantime between time at least i know it's coming so yeah we're going to be busy trying to put those pieces together juice finished all the trim in the beauty room so that's all done and now it's a matter of me getting all the little knickknacks and shit in my room by the time i start using it it probably won't be completely finished but you know as far as the beauty room is concerned it won't be finished because i want it to look kind of lived in and put together but it's like i gotta have everything set up first for me to see exactly what else i need in the room but we got pretty much all the major pieces of furniture that i need i want to get a mirror for the room which is probably another bigger piece of furniture but it's nothing that i have to have in order for me to do what i need to do in the room so i'm really happy about that so anyway i'm actually looking at lights too because um i don't know i feel like I need to get spray paint also, um, because I'm going to spray. Remember those medallions? I'm going to show you the medallion that I got. Um, I'll show you the medallion that I actually got. It's similar to this medallion. Boom. For the room right there. Okay. Very similar to that. Um, but I think it's just a little bit different, a little bit bigger. And um, anyway, got that medallion, and I plan to spray paint it. So it's just a little bit different. Um, I was going to... I was tr trying to decide whether I should make it black or if I should make it silver, and I decided to make it black. So that's what it's going to be. And yeah, I'm just looking at lights because I'm trying to see, um, I don't know, I'm trying to debate on whether I want to do like the hang lights, kind of similar to those up there, but just not that stilo. these two right here, like the ones that are long like that. But I almost feel like if I put them in my ceiling, then that will be exactly where I have to keep my desk. So if I ever want to change my room around, I'd have to put caps where the holes are, where the lights are. And I don't want to do that either. So anyway, but I'm looking. We're going to see what's up. Um, they don't have it here. They might have it at Lowe's. There's one in particular that has these really pretty gems on it. And I think they're at Lowe's. Mm -hmm. I think they're at Lowe's. Anyway, I'm going to Lowe's, I think, too, as well. But I'm going to look to see what kind of curtains they have here. I've already measured out my my, uh, my window. I only have one window in the room. But the good thing is it's got some really great, um, some great daylight that comes in. So hopefully that will help with video making as well. Because some of the best videos are shot with natural daylight versus using lights. You know what I mean? So Because those lights get really, really hot, especially when you're in a small room. Um, and then I want to do something with my curtain. I want to put some like lights on the curtain, like behind it, so that when I shoot at night, I have a nice little background. I know that's very YouTuber-ish, but I've always loved that. So that's another thing I'm going to look into possibly doing if it'll work. I'm not sure though. So anyway, curtains and curtain rods is what I'm looking at right now. And uh, we're going to keep our curtains relatively simple. I'm not trying to go cray cray. I want something like a... I don't know. I've been debating whether I want to do like a pop of color in the room or if I want to keep it the standard color that it is right now. So we're going to play and we're going to see what we can do. I'll let you guys know. But uh, yeah, wish me luck. Look, I've been trying to get this damn beauty room done forever. So we're going to get it done. Damn it. Shit. Okay, so we got out of Home Depot because that shit wasn't going to work. So we're in Walmart. <laughs> and honestly, this is where I should have gone to, in, to begin with because look at all the curtains. Right? So, yeah, if I'm thinking of doing what I want to do, I would need a relatively sheer curtain to do it, right? And if not, then I'll just get an opaque one and I'll be fine. But I don't know if I'm going to have luck finding even a sheer curtain. I might have to get it online if I don't find it at a couple places. So 
I'll also look at some other places like um, Home Goods and stuff like that too. Um, I keep seeing black, I mean white sheer curtains, but not, um, but not black. And I think that's what I'm going for is a black sheer curtain. All right, we're gonna keep on looking, but they have tons of curtains, so we're gonna see what we can find up in here. And uh, yeah, 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 yeah. I don't know. Um, these are kind of relatively sheer, but they're not sheer enough. You know what I'm saying? Like you can see right through them, but they're not sheer enough. Like I almost need them to be a little bit sheerer than this, if I'm not mistaken, for it to work. If I do it, I may not even do what I'm what I'm thinking. I might just give up and go, fuck it. You know what I'm saying? But, we'll see. And they may not just be on display and I'm not looking hard enough. So let me look and see what I can do. Guess who found what they're looking for? Okay. So, and they're cheaper, of course. So, I think I got it. Um, I'm assuming one panel on a curtain means one side of the curtain is what they have. So I'd have to buy two to have both sides. So that is what the curtain pretty much is gonna look like. Kinda, sorta, on crack. See the panel? See the, uh, I'm assuming a panel is that. Tell me if I'm wrong, I don't know. Anyway, that right there, and that's another panel. Right? That's what I'm assuming. Yay! Oh, I hope it works, I don't know. I'm gonna also have blinds too, so that's what I was kinda worried about was whether I should go sheer or not, because sheer will allow daylight in, so if I need to use lighting and I need to black everything out, then, you know, I won't have a way to do that without the sunlight or the daylight coming in through the sheer curtains, right? But I have blinds and my blinds are going to be, um, they actually close really well. The blinds that you guys see in our house is the same blinds I'm putting in my room. So um, I already have the blinds at home, I just have to install them. So that may work. And if worse comes to worse, I need to put something that I can pull down to black out the room I can. But I think this may be okay. And then, I think this might work, I don't know. I'm experimenting. Y'all, I have no clue what I'm doing. I am not a decorator. Like, I can figure out clothing. I can slap on foundation. I can do random shit. You know what I mean? I, can, I just, I, I'm not a decorative person. And, I mean, we did decent for our house. I'm kind of, you know, happy about that. But, huh, when it comes to, like, a little small space like that office, I'm like, I don't know where to even begin with the stuff. So, oh, they have some cute pillows. Ooh, that's kind of cute. See that pillow right there? This one, that's awesome. Oh yeah, oh yeah, that's awesome. Okay. Anyway, I think you guys have an idea of what I'm doing in my room. At least, I think. I think I got what I needed though. Yay, this is really exciting. I mean, I know this may not be exciting for y'all, but it's exciting for me, so now I gotta get a rod. Okay, guys, all this means to me is that there's a chance that Sandy might finish her room sometime this century. Do you see what I'm saying? Like, okay, now I need a rod, right? Now when I was at Home Depot, I found rods, but they were all the same, like the same, like the same color palette, a lot of golds and things like that, and I'm not going for gold in my room, which I know a lot of you guys are probably shocked about because I love gold, but I'm not this time. Um, so yeah, we're gonna see. So I'm looking to see, because here are the shower, I mean shower rods, did I say shower rods, y'all? My bad, I meant to say curtains, curtain rods, anyway. These are the curtain rods, boom, boom, boom. Um, they're kind of, ooh, yeah, they ain't cheap. But um, anyway, my curtains are like $4 and some change, $4.97 a piece for each panel. So I did well with that. So I'm just gonna probably look over here because they have these over here too. I don't need anything over the top ex extravagant because it's just a curtain. Um, that could work. God, they're expensive though. Sheesh. Hold on. Um, here's one. It's kind of a pewter finish. This one right here, kind of like just the plain old ball. Balls. Okay. Um, I don't know. I don't know how I feel. A pewter. Ah, that's not my exact color scheme, really. Mm, I could do black too, but I don't want to do black, 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 black for everything. So, all right. I'm gonna find my my rod. I'm gonna find it. I'm determined. It might be something simple, y'all. I might do something simple like that. You know, it's silver, and that's my scheme, my color scheme. Now I gotta figure out which size to get because I don't have a fucking clue about that shit. Okay, I have my measurements somewhere. I do. So we'll figure it out. We're gonna get it done. Yay, this just means I'm just that much closer. It may not be something that, the beauty room may not be in use in December. Maybe, maybe not. 
but it's definitely gonna be in use in January. I'm determined to get this motherfucker finished. So yes, I'm super ecstatic. And I can finally show you guys, jeez. Uh, okay, all right, let me figure this out. Can we just talk about the fact that these two guys are attached to the hip? I told y'all these little, little this boy. Look, look at these guys right here. Look. Hey, hey. Say hi, everybody. They haven't seen you in a few days. Hmm? We've been shooting late, y'all. And uh, we feed them and then we put them up for Betty by. So, yeah, that's why you haven't seen them in a little while. And we've been out the last couple days. We've been out with my sister. And anyway, I don't even know if you can see them in here because it's kind of dark. I don't have all the lights on. The other little guys back here going potty. Yeah. Huh? Daddy's gonna be home soon. And this little guy has been crying like there's nobody's business because I separated the two of them. Because we're trying to figure out who is the one who keeps having the accidents. And one of them keeps having accidents. And um, we can't tell if we're not watching them like every minute of every single day. <sighs> they just do it, sneak it real quick, and they both look guilty, so we don't know who's done it. Anyway, so yeah, I'm trying to make sure they do what they're supposed to do, right? Anyway, the other little guy's outside, so I thought I'd put him out there, and then um, I took them for a walk, but I don't, he didn't go to the bathroom at all, and it's cold and a motherfucker outside, by the way. Gizmo I'm talking about. Let me turn these lights on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on, Desi. Hold on. Yeah, Desi went, but Gizmo did not, so I'm trying to make sure, I'm trying to make sure his ass goes to the bathroom. And uh, I've been watching it like a hawk, but I know he won't go if I'm watching. But it's like I want to make sure. Anyway, so yeah, y'all, back at the crib. I still haven't even unpacked all the stuff um, from Wally World. But it was a successful, successful trip. Just got done shooting Real Hospitals of Atlanta recap. So that's going to be it by the time you guys see this video here. So check it out if you haven't ch have had a chance on the other channel. Say hi, Desi. You eating my finger? Uh-uh. Anyway, hold on one second, let me go get Gizmo. What up, yo? Y'all, let me tell you how damn near impossible it was for me to get my husband out the damn house to come to the Dagon gym. <sighs> okay. Struggle with straight real. Look, ever since we got the cable package that we got, which includes NBA TV, I promise y'all, I can't get him out the damn house. And that's the honest to God truth. And I know y'all probably like, oh yeah, you can come. Why don't you come earlier in the day? Problem with that is, is that he comes home so late from work that, you know, he would go to the gym when I mean, he does go. And I wouldn't really see him, you know what I'm saying? Before we would have to eventually hit the sack to get up for the next day, you know what I mean? So it's kind of our way to kind of still do stuff together, keep ourselves accountable. And just, you know, get our workouts in, all with being able to see each other and shit, you know what I mean? Anyway, Juice, should be here any second, I think he's gonna do the tread with me. If not, he may be doing the Stairmaster, as he always does. I'm gonna do my tread, and get to work. But yeah, ever since we got NBA TV, it's been a wrap, y'all. That motherfucker won't get, get anywhere near, like away from the TV. Like tonight, he stalled and stalled. I was like, nope, not today. He came, he came home. I was in my workout clothes. I was like, you ain't gonna do this to me today, dude. And uh, I almost left him, but then he was like, no, 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 I wanna go, I wanna go. So that's what I said to him today. I was like, I'm gonna dip set. And he was like, oh, no, 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 I'm going, I'm going. And that's when he got up. So I guess that's what I have to start doing now, just being like, I'm gonna go. Cause he look <laughs> quiet as kept. Um, if he sees that I'm starting to get really back into shape and all this kind of stuff, that's when he all of a sudden is like, oh shit, let me get in that damn gym, you know what I mean? Because you know, he don't want to be the only one. Anyway. Ah. Anyway, I actually pulled out an oldie, oldie but goodie and pulled out some um, uh, of Jamie's workouts from back in the day when I was... Uh, going to him and so I just wanted to kind of rev things up and do some different stuff so I pulled out his workouts and I have them here with me so that I can kind of just 
do that, just kind of get more on a schedule and stuff because I've been kind of, you know, typically I'll do like Monday, legs, Tuesday this, Wednesday that. I got off track, especially because our schedules have been late. It's just been weird lately. So, um, that being said, I'm doing some of Jamie's workouts this week to get Reb back up again. Hopefully after the new year I can go back to Jessica once a week, maybe Juice and I on Saturdays. We'll see. So, yeah. Anyway. Let me get this workout started. y'all <laughs> it is time to shut it down i don't even know if you can see anything on my face i was kind of munching on some chicken it is now 11 51 in the evening and i am just now finishing finally finishing my real house was of atlanta recap and uh, like i literally imported the footage as we were heading out to the gym so that when I came back, all I had to do was just edit because the importing is also a very long process. For any of you guys who do videos, you guys already know. And then y'all know I put a lot of effects on my videos. So that takes a lot of time also. So I've been sitting here for the last however long, forever and a damn day. <laughs> came home, showered, literally showered, rushed out the shower so that I could make my man his dinner. And uh, he's already fed. He is already in the bed you can probably hear him in the background he's like settling down and um so yeah made him his food while trying to finish this too at the same time so that's why i'm in the kitchen working working or whatever but anyway finally finished um yeah on the other channel if you guys have not checked already just know that on my other channel which is the socialite life the socialite life which is always linked down in the description box make sure you guys check out the holiday giveaways that are going to be going on my real house was of Atlanta recap is going to be up by the time you guys see this for sure and I will continue to do them but you know Mike Brown and Eric, Eric Garner just that I just wasn't in the mindset for it after that happened and um after the grand jury decision and all that kind of stuff but now i feel like i'm kind of getting back to my my huge okay um i just felt like i wanted a little more in a little bit you know what i mean take a second however you will notice that there are going to be a lot of videos coming on both channels this channel and the other channel as well because obviously i'm going to vlog every day but in addition to the fact that i'm going to be putting a lot of holiday giveaways over there as well we definitely plan on doing something here don't worry we did not forget about you guys for show but um, I've got a lot of product reviews and things that you guys will really like too. So, um, and some swatches and some makeup reviews you guys have been asking me specifically for. So it's going to be a busy next couple weeks. But check the other channel also so that you can enter in to win any of the giveaways that are going on over there as well. It's not, you guys are not excluded from this either, just FYI. So, um, uh, yeah, anyway, I'm just rambling. I love you guys. Um, sorry, Juice didn't get a chance to say goodnight to you guys, but he is exhausted. And by the way, today, just FYI, I did um, my little workout, one of Jamie's workout that, workouts that he originally gave me. And oh my God, I feel so good. Like, I haven't done one of his workouts in the, in its entirety in a long time. Like, I've done snippets of his workouts where I've picked up on different things, like for chest and back and biceps or whatever. But I haven't done a full-on workout from start to finish, every single thing that he put on the list for me to do. And today, like in a while, you know, not since I was doing it consistently with him, and it felt great. So that's what I'm going to do to kind of just keep me in check for the holiday season. That's what, that's what I'm saying right now, verbally, so I could be held accountable, is to continue to do those workouts because they're very hard. And it just it's a great calorie burner because, you know, the holidays, I'm going to eat whatever I want. I already said pretty much a couple months ago that that's pretty much what's going to happen around this time of year but the big thing is to really make sure that I stay in the gym and that I eat those things in moderation so throughout the week Monday through Friday I eat really really well um although I haven't shown you guys what I've been eating lately because I honestly this is literally what I've been doing bam like computer typing computer 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 and that's really all I've been doing that and coffee or I'll go run to the store and a lot of times when I go to the store, like Walmart or Target or whatever, it's literally to get myself away from the computer. That's literally what it is. I know you guys are probably like, damn, every day you do this. It's literally because, honestly, 
you know, I work from home, so I don't have a lot of interaction, human interaction. So, you know, just to get out and get some air, it's refreshing and it's healthy. You know what I mean? Anyway, okay, I'm done rambling. I love you guys. Hope you guys have a great evening, night, day, whenever y'all are watching this shit right up in through here. And I love y'all. And I'll see y'all. I know, I went back to the other channel with that little ending right there. Anyway, love y'all and I'll see y'all manana. Love y'all.